All right, look, I wanted to upload a video of me unlocking camos today for some of the new weapons, but I am not close enough to be able to get that video done today. So in other news, we're gonna be fighting order again, but this time we're gonna be using the Ray K. Recently, the Ray K just got buffed here in season six. So we're gonna be testing it out against them and seeing if it's any better. And since I saw some of you got mad that I say some weapons are OP or good against them, I'm gonna let you guys decide. So today we're doing the Ray K versus Orda. And the weapon we're gonna be using until we can get our Ray K is the new Gallo Mastercraft. It is the blast matic It's basically the Ray Gun. Really quick, if you're curious on its attachments, it has the Duckbill Choke, the Cavalry Lancer Barrel, the SWAT 5 milliwatt laser, the 12 round tube, and the marathon stock. Not bad attachments. Also, this is what it looks like with mastery camos on it. Here's the gold viper, plague diamond, and dark aether. The coverage on dark aether is, I think, even better than just vanilla gallo. So that's pretty cool. But I'm just going to be keeping it as is. And obviously, we're going to be using ring of fire. But we got no time to waste. Let's hop on firebase and try to get our ray K as fast as possible. All right, here we go. Twin driving us in again. First time in a while. It's also lagging a bit. Hopefully, it smooths out. All right, first, let's see what this thing can do. Ooh, that looks kind of cool. That almost looks better than like the normal ray gun animation. Does this thing have a nice inspect on it? Kind of just looks like the normal Gala one. Wait. Oh, wait, batteries. Okay. So basically, it's just like a normal Gala uh, inspect. You just load batteries into it. Oh, it looks like all the shells are batteries. That's kind of cool. Okay, grab our loose change. And let's try to work to our Ray K as fast as possible. Actually, first, let's get power on. Then we do Ray K. Shut your mouth back. Yep, got him. I almost forgot to turn on the Rampage Inducer. I'm going back. All right, go ahead and turn on. Let's go. Now, I don't know if I'm going to waste the points on it because this is the Ray K video. But if we do have a little extra, I wonder if this blueprint looks the same as the Ray Gun Pack-A-Punch. That'd be a cool little touch. Get off me, zombies. And you get these doors open. And we don't have to worry about going for camos today. We can kind of just play. Kind of crazy when we don't really have an objective besides kill Orda. Come on, zombies. Spawn. Actually, it's a rampage and dudes, so they spawn pretty fast. How much do I need to open this door? 200 more. Okay, there we go. Grind the rail. Oh, it's nice to do that again. We need a little more money. There we go. Start it up. Go to the reactor, pal. It feels nice to be using the gallo again. And with this blueprint... It even looks nice. Ooh, we're on round four. Did we really turn the reactor on at round three? Or at least get it started? Look at us being efficient. Max ammo, we take those. And that's our reactor. On to the next one. I'd pick up the pace if I were you. Shut your mouth back. Starting up the reactor. I don't think I grabbed my loose change at the last reactor, so I'm gonna have to go back. The iron sights on this blueprint are sick. It's just like the ray gun. Except with a whole lot of shotgun behind it. I think we need like one or two more kills. These guys should do it. There we go. And that's our second reactor done. Grind the rail. Ooh, still got it. No, I was literally in the middle of stimming. That's horse shit. Okay, we don't have a self revive anymore. Can we grab our loose change without dying? Let's go. No. There's so many zombies now. Get out of the way. All right, pop this open. Let's try jumping over this, grabbing this loose change. Let's get this reactor on. Still a lot of zombies here. Hey, you know what? Ring of fire. Eat it, all of you. Let's go. We got the reactor on so fast doing that. Okay, we have enough to get pack a punch, but we don't need pack a punch for this weapon. We need to get the Ray K. So let me open this door. We can grab the blueprint. Man, I wish this guy was pack. Come here, young man. Ooh, what a delicious treat. Stab. We got the blueprint in the eye. Now we need to go back and get the key. Actually, before we keep doing this, I'm gonna go turn the rampage inducer off. That way I don't just get murked. All right, rampage inducer. Burn off. I'm gonna buy a quick revive since we're right here. Let's put the eye in on the computer. Go ahead, scan that. And we'll take that key. I guess we'll buy this door. We'll test it on these lockers. That's a mimic spawn. Oh, there's the mimic. Hello, mimic. That's not the right mimic. Let's keep opening the lockers. Okay, all the lockers in this one are open. Where's the mimic? There it is. I don't want to kill this last zombie though. So let's try to run. Make sure the mimic's ahead of him. There we go. There's our part. Okay, we need one more thing and then we're all set until a mangler spawns. Let me pull up a chart because it's so much easier. All right, let's start the computer. 10. Zombie, go away. I didn't see the second one. So 10 something eight. I need to figure out what the second number is. Let's start it up again. No, it started moving again before I could see it. I need a decoy or something. The zombie's getting on my nerves. Okay, I have a decoy. Okay, 10. What is that one? Five. So ten, five, eight. I think that's it. 
Okay, decoy just don't work. 10, 5, 8. Hopefully I have enough to buy the revolver and spawn because I'm definitely not going to be able to shoot it with my shotgun. Okay, here's the revolver. Of course I get dual wield. Hold on, apply blueprint. Let's just do this one. No, I don't want to dual wield. I just want one magnum. There we go. 10, 5, 8. 10. Zombie, I swear to God. Reload slower, please. Okay. 10, 5, 8. Bullseye. Is that it? 10, 5, 8. Bullseye. There we go. All right, we have all the parts besides the mag now. And I would turn Rampage Inducer back on, but I really have no money for perks or anything, and I really don't feel like restarting. Let's try to get as many kills here as we can so we can get our points up. Then I'll hit the nuke. Get the fuck off me. Need a C4. Idiots. Can we upgrade our armor at all? Nope. We spent our salvage on that decoy that didn't work. So I'm going to grab Speed Cola. We can do the Bunny Easter Egg real quick and try to get Jug. Actually, we'll do it at the end of this round. Because I'm just going to sit here and get hit. All right, there's a nuke. That's the end of the round. Let's hurry up and do the bunny so we can get free jug. Come on, bunny. There we go. Now fly to me. Come on. There we go. Oh, wait. The zombie's dancing. Get it. Goodbye, bunny. Oh, free armor. Thanks, Mimic. Goodbye, bunny. That's all of them. Actually, maybe we'll get the red K from the box. Nope. Wishful thinking, though. But this bison or the bullfrog is going to be better than the magnum. We have 5K. We might as well pack punch this at least once. That way we can stay alive. Get all these zombies out of here. But let's go ahead and take a look at this. Eh, I guess this is probably what the ray K or, or the ray gun would look like. Well, pack a punch. Not bad. All right. What can we buy now? Let's get death perception. That way we can get some salvage up. Speaking of salvage, what can we upgrade? Let's get our armor level two. And now that we're basically set up and we're waiting for that mangler, let's hit our rampage inducer again and go sing kernels. Actually, oh, mimic, shut up. Get out of here. But we're not going to sit in kernels. I'm going to go there. Pay my tributes, and we're going to go to the faster spawn spot. Hello, boys. Nice to see you again. And, okay, let's go. And also, this weapon already comes with, like, a pseudo ammo mod. It comes with, I'm pretty sure, that skull and crossbones is brain rot. So, if you want to get any other kind of ammo mod on it, tough titties. But against manglers and stuff, it'll do a little extra damage without having to pay for it. It's actually perfect that we're trying to grind through rounds in here because this is where we're gonna have to build the rake anyways insta kill we need that yeah, i'm pretty sure manglers start showing up at like what round 15 something like that also i forgot there's other assault waves so we're gonna have to go deal with those at some point as for right now we're big chilling and okay, maybe not big chilling maybe just like small chilling double points and bonus points let's go that one two combo okay let's just ring a fire this out make sure we get as many points as we can while this double points is still active there we go. Flying through these rounds. I need a stun because I need to reload. Oh my god, stun work, please. I'm just going to nade. What happened to all my nades? Where'd they go? There's another one. Jeez. I'm out of ammo too. Oh, self-revive dropped. Let's go. I need ammo bad. I can buy some in here. All right, well, it's insta-kill. Let's ring a fire. Easy shit. Oh, there's our assault wave. Let's grab this Semtex. Any other goodies in here? Just stims. We can upgrade our armor to level three. Really don't care about this assault wave. So I'm going to go back and get some perks. Because after this round, our mangler will spawn. We'll be able to shoot its gun, get the mag, and then we need to charge it for one round. Then we can build the Ray K. All right, let's get stamina up. Let's get dead shot. Let's get mule kick. So we're not running out of ammo. Let's get PhD. We can also get elemental pop. And we almost have all of our perks already. All right, I guess I'll go help out. It's already taken like insane damage. Let's see if we can stop them. Oh, it's on the red. Okay, they took out the first one. I don't know where all the zombies went though. It looks like there's only two here. These zombies need to stay away from this reactor. Leave it alone. You know what? I'll bring a fire on them. See if they like it. And that's the round. Let's go. All right, we've made it back. Hopefully we can survive. Oh, Stim. I'm pinned back here. Go, C4. No, I accidentally opened this door. Oh, they had me cornered and I had to use the C4. I ruined the spot. That sucks. I hate that the blowing up the C4 and opening the door is the same button. And the mob that we need, the mangler is stuck back there. Let's see if we can get him to respawn somewhere. Let's run all the way over here. Actually, you know what? Since he's going to be stuck and take his time, I'm just going to get brain rot for real on this. Okay, ammo mods, brain rot. And we can get tombstone. So now we're full on our perks. Come on out, mangler. Why are you stuck? Why do you do this? All right, I guess I'll go back. See if you respawn better up here. No, I don't actually, Dr. Gray, because he's stuck inside of a wall. Mangler, go ahead and spawn for me, please. I really need that part that you have. Come on. There we go. He's actually walking. I gotta really make sure that we shoot his gun out. I swear if I brain rot him. 
Oh my god. You're a pain in the ass, you know that? I can't even like sit in here anymore. So I fucked all the spawns up. I guess I can sit right here for now. Hopefully another mangler spawns. I don't know what the spawn rates are, these low rounds. It looks like he's not coming here. I'm just gonna run in a circle here and nade everybody. I don't even care. All right, there goes the nade. Easy 1800 kills. I can hear a mangler. I'm gonna shoot all these zombies first, get all the brain rot out of the gun system. There we go. We got our part. Let's throw it on the charger before zombies start spawning. There we go. Now we just need to wait around and we can build our Ray K. And if we're lucky and our assault wave comes after this round, we can build it free of charge. Don't have to worry about any zombies. Oh, let's go. You all charged up? What? Oh, uh, come on, Dr. Gray. Don't cock me like that. Yes, we have to go do our assault wave. Get our armor a little bit. And let's just upgrade this one time. I don't want to waste too much salvage on it because we're going to be using the Ray K after this round. And there's our Napalm Strike. I've been seeing people saying that a Napalm Strike has been removed from zombies. That's still right here. I think it's just on uh, Forsaken that you can't use it because most of it's indoors. But I know you can use like Chopper Gunner and things like that. So I don't know what they're up to in there. Bring it, zombies. It's way too easy. Is that all of them? It is. Okay, let's try to get there as fast as possible. Maybe we can build it before spawns start going crazy. Because our rampage inducer just ended. They're not going to be as fast. Throwing down the decoy. Let's... Oh, I still need to grab this. I would have grabbed the mag first. It would have worked. Oh, wait. I have another decoy. Shout out, mule kick. Building it. It's been built. Let's swap it out with our bullfrog. Oh, get off me. God damn it. Get this zombie out of here so I can get back up. Thank you. Oh, are you kidding me? That was my mule kick gun? I'm pissed. So if I want my Ray K back, I need to go get mule kick again. I hate it here. Let's buy our perks back. There we go. Our Ray K is here. I'm honestly using this napalm strike. Fuck it. Get him. That really didn't kill too many. First thing we're going to do is take this bullfrog over here. Drop it so we have a magnum on the ground. And now we're going to switch our Ray K out for the bullfrog. And now this is our first gun. This is our second gun. And now the Ray K is our second gun. So we won't lose it if we go down again. I'm actually mad that we accidentally opened that door. Because now we can't just fly through the rounds to get to Orda. It's going to be so much slower. But so far, it's looking like the noob tube portion of the Ray K is doing a lot better. We have insta-kill on, but even before that, I was slowing these zombies down and getting them killed nice and easy. Let's go ahead and pack-a-punch it. Zombie, get off of me. All right, but this is what the Ray K looks like with pack-a-punch one, in case you've never seen it. Honestly, one of the coolest Wonder Weapon designs, but it was severely underpowered until now. At least I hope so. Let's keep noob tubing in here. Let's ring a fire so it does a little extra damage. It's looking pretty nice right now. I just have to turn and shoot. Assuming I don't run out of ammo, I should be fine. It slows them down so much too. It's like toxic growth almost. And I know you can switch firing modes and shoot like the noob tube version on the ground. And it doesn't even bigger an explosion, but that's too much work. I guess we could test it. All right, let's see. Throw that down, switch it. Nice. Guess I'm just grinding rounds here. I think the spawns are faster than kernels. A little more dangerous, but not with this baby. All right, let's get this pack punch too. Oh, there's one zombie left. There's a little crawler. Let's try this version. Go on. All right, what perk do we need back? Let's get elemental back so we can cherry. Insta-kill, perfect. That helps us out a lot. With PhD, you can kind of even just shoot it onto yourself. Oh, I so wish that we had our old spot. Those spawns are so much faster. I'm pissed that C4 did that. But I guess we can always come back and try some high rounds on Firebase. We haven't really gone for high rounds on this map. I want to at least attempt to go to round 100 on each map. I think that'd be pretty fun. Let's pick up Death Perception. This is kind of busted. We can bring a fire too to make it even better. I'm just going to sit in this corner and shoot it. This is so busted. Just as it's running out, I shoot another one. But now without Ring of Fire, I'll have two up at the same time. I'm running a little low on ammo, so let's pick some up. And we're already back in business. We got three rounds to get 20k and get this to pack a punch three. I think we can do it. Let's hit another ring of fire. And just keep tossing them down. This is so busted. This is no effort. An insta kill? Even better. This thing actually just slices through them all. I'm actually just gonna start spamming it. Oh, double points? We'll get a 30k in no time. Oh, we're already at 30k. Let me shoot a few down. I'm gonna shoot till I'm out of ammo. Then we can grab pack three. Pretty sure that's a round. But this is what the Ray K looks like with Pack-A-Punch 3 on it. Very, very clean. Ah, uh, I don't know how that's not hurting the fingers there. Actually getting shocked. All right, back to our regular scheduled programming. The only thing that's really getting through are Hellhounds. They can kind of just run underneath the orbs. Is this thing called the Discordian Harmonizer? When me and the homies sing in Discord? And we're on round 30. Now it's just the waiting game until Orta gets here. So let's grab Tombstone. 
Okay, the rank A is actually pretty fire now. This feels so mindless. It's probably awful for high rounds, but if I were doing this in the actual weapons lab area and I didn't open the door, rounds would be flying by so fast and we'd be a little safer. Oh, it's just you? You have one all to yourself. Might as well pack a bunch of Gallo again. We got nothing else to spend this money on. Once you have a ring of fire, it's literally you can just not do anything. I'm not even looking at the game. I'm looking right at you guys. You see this? Not even looking. Just getting kills. No effort gaming right here. I'll just take this nuke. Maybe I'll end the round. Not looking like it. Still no Orda? He's really taking his time. He's scared. He's like, oh shit. This guy's been beating my ass left and right. And now the wonder weapon got like buffed. Yeah, I'd be scared too, Orda. This is such a cheat code. This actually might be a good way to farm XP. It is double XP right now. And if there wasn't like a weird cap on like zombies XP, we'd probably just get to level 1000 without thinking. All right, so this is a Mangler's health. And then this is his health after one orb. It slowly trickles down. Let's do one orb and then shoot it. Gone, dead. Oh, an aura showing up. Let's go. And just because we have so much salvage, let's get this blue, purple, and gold. That's fully up. But it's time, Orda. Let's see what this Ray K can do against you. I'm gonna be a little late. That's fine. It'll give him enough time to spawn in. Some zombies time to spawn in. I can nade them and get our ring of fire going. Let's go. I guess we get to see how base Ray K does against them too. Right now we have a normal firing mode. What is it doing? Is it even reaching? Oh wait, I don't think I have the setting on. So that shows up. So let's do that. Damage numbers are back on. It's doing 900 per shot, which isn't crazy. There's a lot of normal guns that do better than that. I guess we'll see when it gets close if the orbs can do the same. But for now, let's just nade these zombies. Hopefully we can get our ring of fire going. A little more nade. All right, we have our ring of fire. Let's use it. 1500, 1600, not bad. Okay, that's pretty decent. I wanna see what the orbs can do because I'm pretty sure the orbs were the main thing that were buffed. Hey, zombies, leave me the hell alone. Can I hit him from here with the orb? Oh wait, he's critting. Oh, reload faster. 1800 per shot in his crit. That's not bad take these shots we got them half health a little under that the fire rate on this kind of helps with uh, the lack of damage come on just take it orda oh he's critting let's go 1800 per shot oh they're about to take this thing down oh that's the other one we're fine us freaking out oh no we're out of ammo let's drop down and buy some throw a nade on this reactor keep it clean might as well just clear off all the zombies on here. I don't think more will spawn. Orda is getting close. No. Ring of fire. Change the firing mode on it. It's doing 1,200 per shot. 2,400 per shot. No, we got to kill him before he's done. No, there were zombies on me that whole time. Self-revive. Am I out of ammo? Why did it switch off? Oh, I'm out. I lost it with mule kick. What? I thought I switched my weapon out. Well, that was a clusterfuck. And power's off. Man. But I don't think the Ray K is too bad against him. I think that was just poorly planned by me. We didn't have a ring of fire to start. And we're kind of a little too focused on the, the actual reactor. So I guess I'll go tell 40 and we'll try again. We'll give this thing some retribution. That's so unfortunate. So I know this thing can do better. Now we're gonna have to test it against the stronger order. We just have to plan better. So laying the bomb, then shooting it does do a significant amount of damage, but it's just so hard to just switch between firing modes and do that consistently. Okay, maybe it is pretty good. I mean, I knew it was pretty good, but I'm just lazy. This is just the normal firing mode with Ring of Fire. It's kind of crazy. Is that 76,000 damage I just saw? Oh, 138,000. So with the dead shot boost and ring of fire, this thing's insane. Okay, next time we see Orda, we're not taking it easy on him. Once we get our next assault wave, I'm just gonna buy like Gersh's and I'm gonna throw those by the reactor so I don't have to worry about them. Round 42, come on Orda. We don't got all day here. Start showing up. He's late for work. 43 and he's still not here, come on. Breaking my balls, Orda. Breaking my balls. Let's go. All right, we have our Gersh's. We have Orda coming in. If we have as much ammo as we can get, first thing I want to do, switch out this QBZ or the Ray K. That way we know for sure it's our second weapon. Unless I fuck that up again. Don't think I did, but we can start right away with our ring of fire. And we have a cruise missile. So if the zombies start getting too crazy, we can cruise missile. We can use our Gersh's. We got a lot of options now. Come on in. Get some shots in. 1500 per shot, 1600 per shot. Not bad. Still doing the same amount of damage. The zombies are getting close. I'm throwing a Gersh. 
Come on, Orta, take it. All right, it's, it's doing a decent amount of damage. It's not bad against him. Oh, he's critting. I got to throw the Gersh now. Hit the crit while we can. Let's go. That was a good amount of damage. I'm buying more Gershes. Okay, now zombies are close. Another Gersh going out. And we have another Ring of Fire. Easy. We got damage start to stack up. Okay, we got him about to half health. And now we need to buy ammo. Okay, throw the Gersh. Hit the crit while we can. 2,500 now. That's not bad at all. No, I'm going to go down. Cruise missile time. Let's take out the rest of these zombies or as much as we can. All right, let's try this mode against them. It doesn't look like this mode does too much. Unless we can blow it up. Let's try it again. No! We can't get the blow up on them. Oh, and all the zombies are on me. Oh, it's close. Oh, I don't think we can get them. It's close, but it's not good enough. Dang. Even with the buffs, it still can't take out Orda. Oh, well. That's pretty disappointing. I guess I'll just let these zombies have their way with me. Go ahead, zombies. Let's tombstone shadow. Wow, look how cool I am on the ground. And it's over. 3,000 kills. That's that's not too bad. All right, well, overall, I think the, the Ray K buff, it's nice against zombies now. Like, you can kind of just sit there and use that. I don't know how it was before. I never really tried to just use the Ray K for too long. Maybe a few games here and there. But it's all right. I, I don't think the buff is anything too crazy. Unless I'm just completely ass cheeks, which is entirely possible. But both times, we couldn't kill Orda. First time, you know, maybe we could have if we would have focused a little more on him. Second time, I felt like we did a pretty good job of managing both the reactor and shooting at him. So, I mean, it's Take, take from this what you will. But with all that being said, I'm gonna have to end the video here. If you guys like this and you wanna see more, go ahead and leave a like on it. If you didn't, you don't. Dislike. If you're new here, please hit the subscribe and put all kinds of COD content throughout the week. But that's gonna be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.